Hello everyone, welcome back and welcome new viewers to some more Stormworks. We are back in classic career mode here at our new harbor base and last time we were here we were working on a big massive boat. Uh, so we're gonna do some of that today but I think we're kind of short on some cash so we also might have to do some missions. We'll see. Let's go ahead and start running around here. Let's figure out what we got. Uh, let's see, we do have 157,000 and 187 research points. Are we researching something? Yes we are. We got sensors going. That's good. Uh, do we have any good missions in the world right now that we could uh, get to? Ooh, we've got an impact event coming close to us. We might need to get out of this zone, honestly. Servicing a boat, conduct repairs on a fishing boat. That could be good. Uh, let's see. We've got some stuff way down here and way out here. A tugboat requires conduct repairs on a tugboat and conduct repairs here on this. Maybe we go out here and we do these two missions. Uh, that could be a couple... Uh, couple grand on each of these and it would get us out of the impact zone um what do we use though do we use do we use the boat from the very beginning that would be this boat right here so we spawn this in go do some missions how much is that 15 is there some stuff that we can add to this uh I, it's been so long since we've had this boat i don't remember what uh what it actually needs let's spawn it in let's spawn it in and jump on it and let's see oh it's such a tiny boat in this area it's so tiny okay let's go get on it I'm sure it's missing a lot of stuff since the last time we upgraded this thing. Uh, we do have modular engines on it, though, so that's good. Uh, we don't have... Are we leaking fuel? I feel like that's happening. Are we leak... It's... Are we already started up? No, this thing just... Uh, it just leaks fuel. How is that... Where's the... I don't see the spill. I'm so confused. I'm so confused. Anyway, let's go ahead and get in the seat. Let's get it... Oh, okay. Too much power. Too much power. That was a thing. All right, so... Let's go to this one over here. It is the closest one. How far away is it? Six and a half K shouldn't be too bad. Uh, we should be able to get there pretty quick. I'm trying to remember what all we, we needed to do to this. The boat was very simple. It did, uh, I hate that we're losing so much fuel though. That's uh, that's kind of concerning. Uh, but we had everything else that we needed on here. Ooh, speed was not hooked up. We don't know how fast we're going. That's okay. We've already gone about a kilometer, so we're moving pretty quick. And we've got flat water, I, that's awesome. All right, repair the spotlight on the Big Valley fishing boat. I don't see this guy yet. We're still like, two, we're still like 2K away from it. And it's foggy and we're getting a little bit of waves here. So hopefully this isn't too difficult. Oh, eyes on. There they are right there. Okay, should be quick and easy. This should be a quick and easy one, hopefully. I don't know why they need uh, services all the way out here for a spotlight. I'm pretty sure they can make it back to base without a spotlight, but you know, it is what it is. Uh, let's go ahead and slow up here a little bit. I don't want to create more of an incident than we already have. I don't need to repair our boat as well. Okay, so let's slow up. Come on. Turn a little bit. We'll go ahead and slow down here. Okay, we don't need our fire extinguisher. We can get rid of that. And we need the welder. Okay, there's a ladder right here. Perfect. Let's go jump on that. I'm here to fix your, fix your light bulb way up here. There we go. How do you get up there? Oh, this is a cool boat. How do I get up here? Up this way and up the ladder. Nope. Hello. Hello. Can I get this ladder, please? Thank you. We'll come all the way up top. Hey, we'll get a nice view while we're up here through the fog. All right, let's repair this. Oop, flashies. Is this gonna repair all the way? Can it Can it fix it? There we go. Two grand. Okay, conduct repairs. All right, cool. Well, let's uh, move on from here. How do I get down? Here we go. And onto my boat. Nope, onto my boat. Nope, onto my boat. Yes, here we go. All right, let's get out of here. Ooh, too much, too much, too much. No, 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 no. <sighs> uh, this game, you guys, this game, this game. I'm dying, I'm dying. Well. I'm having awesome luck, so yeah. All right, let's try, let's just try something here. I don't think it's gonna work, but we're gonna try it. Oh, come on, I can't get off this. They fixed the ropes and they didn't fix the ropes and they fixed the ropes and they didn't fix the ropes. I don't know what to expect out of ropes anymore. Okay, well this pull the boat. We, we have lost all pulling power now in game. Even as a host, you cannot move stuff. Can I move this boat? I just wanna move this boat. Look, I just wanna swim it over to here without drowning. Just to right there. Just to right there. Just to right there. Come on. I just want to get on this boat, and then I can, like, try and flip this boat over. Nope. I just want to get right to there. Just to right there. Just to right there. Just to right there. All right. Well, um, cool. Well, we got far trying to make some money. Uh, clearly, the boat flips now. I, I just feel like everything is break... Oh, is that a chest way out there? It is a chest. It is a chest. You know what? Let's go make some money here. If we're, if we're struggling to make some cash, let's at least get something. That is a chest. Perfect. Perfect. We'll grab this chest. We'll at least made some money having left another vehicle in the world. All right. How much we get for this, uh, this loot box? 4,000. Okay. So we've made 6,000 a day. That's good. 
And six research points. And now we're just bobbing around here like shark bait. Uh, let me get back to... Oh, oh, don't go under. Don't go under. We don't need that. We need to stay on top of the water where there's oxygen. And my boat's still running. Like, it's, it's somehow still getting air, even though it's flipped upside down. Uh, so it's just wasting all of our gas. We might have to jump into the seat here, too, and turn this thing off. Don't know how well that's going to work. We can get our oxygen mask ready, though. All right, where is the driver's seat? Let's see if we can get into here and turn this thing off. Okay, driver's seat off out of the out of the seat there we go perfect okay now it's not gonna be wasting the fuel that's here hopefully it will turn off here in a second no why is it whoa why is it dragging me into the thing too what's going on here okay you know what let's we're gonna throttle everything down maybe that will keep it from uh running okay finally finally they're, they're done as the sun's setting uh we are stranded here on another boat uh out in the ocean i um, not sure why i flipped there apparently i just had too much power uh awesome um so yeah Guys, I, I, this this season's a complete disaster. Uh, I'm I'm almost to the point where I'm gonna go back and just scum save this. Uh, I got I had a save right before we left, and I might just go back and just not consider any of this part of the episode. Uh, let me know what you guys think. I really want to get back and work on the boat. Uh, that was the whole point of today's episode was to get back and work on the boat, but I wanted a little bit more cash so we could actually spawn in the boat. And yeah, things happened. So now we have another vehicle in the world to rescue, uh, besides the, uh, the VTOL over there. So we're going to get some good use out of our, out of our rescue ship. If we can ever get back and maybe we'll be swimming back. Maybe we won't. All right, you guys, it's the next day. I thought about it. I wasn't going to leave it there. I think what I'm just going to do is drown my character and get back to base and do the building that I intended to do today. We've lost some money. It's okay. Let's get back to building, and then we'll come rescue this boat, and then we'll rescue the VTOL, and all will be well. All right, with that being said, let's go ahead and do this. I think it's just fine. Let's go ahead and get rid of this guy. We're only losing the supplies. It is what it is. I really just want to build. I'm so tired of uh, the problems that we keep having. Oh, the noise. The noise is terrible. Luckily, we don't have that much help. All right, so hopefully it took us back to a base that we own. Is that the case? Do we own this base? Yes, this is our base. Okay, so let's go ahead and get some sleep. Let's make it daytime so we can actually see. All right, sensors are done. All right, so next day, extinguish all fires and rescue one casualty. Yeah, we're not going anywhere right now. Not at all. Um, So, where do we sit now? We sit at 147,000 with 194 research points. Our research was done. So we're probably going to go for uh, large boat stuff because we're going to need that kind of things. Uh, an hour and five minutes on that. That should be pretty simple to get done. Uh, let's go ahead and I guess we'll sleep that off and get those parts. All right. Large boats has been researched. Let's go through some of these points here. I don't know why this is still showing. Uh, so now we got shipping. We've got the, the large pitchable props and the giant repellers. We might need those. Uh, on this big boat. I don't see anything else that's super crucial. Diving equipment might might be. Uh, large batteries might be. Yeah, I think I'm going to do the, the large props here just in case we need them. Uh, I feel like this boat's going to need them. Uh, so we'll get those going. Uh, those won't be as important right now. Let's go ahead and jump into the workbench. I want to start building a little bit. If we do find that we need those big ones, we can just go sleep those off real quick. Uh, but let's get our boat here. All right, when we left off, this is what we had. Uh, we had a pretty good base here. You guys gave me a lot of good ideas. Uh, I think one thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna slide this bridge back. I don't think there's enough buoyancy up here uh, for the mass that we have here. And I'm gonna slide this back just a little bit. I might get rid of these little side areas here. I don't know if we need those as well. Maybe we'll just kind of make them an open covered area or something. Uh, you guys talked about opening up this back here. Uh, God, I had a lot of ideas from you guys. Let me just jump in and start building and we'll see where we end up.
All right, I've uh, been building for a while. Let's spawn it in and see what we've got here. Okay, so clearly we don't have all the parts unlocked, so we don't have everything on here yet, but uh, you guys can kind of get the idea of what's going on here. We've got a big crane system here that we can be able to move back and forth along the deck here. We've got a long winch system here. We'll be able to put two massive winches here. That's the idea. I'm gonna have two big winches here. Uh, to be able to control this, there'll be a lift, pretty much anything we probably, probably try to lift up. It'll probably sink the boat before we uh, actually lift it if we do something like that. But anyway, we got a nice ramp here to kind of slide things up onto the deck. I kind of want to do a thing where we can open the deck here. Haven't got uh, hinges yet to kind of figure that out. But overall, just a lot of extra work here to the boat. Uh, we've got the stairs now, so we can kind of come up here and check out the helm area, which is nice. Uh, so we can come up here. We've got nice visibility all around. Uh, we can pretty much see everything on the boat. Uh, we'll put some cameras in here so we can see the areas that we do have blind spots on, but we can see pretty much everything here, which is nice. Uh, once we get railings, we'll get rid of these guys here, and that should make this a little bit easier to see through. Uh, the boat's still leaning a little bit forward, which is fine. Uh, once we add engines and fuel, uh, it should balance out, which will be great. Uh, let's see, second floor here. Not sure we're going to make this but is it is nice it's a nice gathering room so maybe a bunch of equipment in here maybe a bunch of sleeping quarters things like that i'm not sure yet we've got a whole bunch of area here to work with uh, if you guys have any ideas let me know uh probably do some spotting here maybe a handle here to do some controls maybe do some side driving for docking uh not sure there maybe we could do one up here as well uh i'm not sure yet i'm not sure yet we've got a lot of ideas to work with uh, i got a little walkway here we can get across which is nice uh, we can come down here We've got a door in the center here. And I'm not sure if I want doors out or in. Uh, I'm not sure, what do you guys think? Should they go out or should they go in? I think a lot of ships, the exterior doors go out, but I could be wrong on that. Um, let me let me know down in the comments. I'm curious to know, it, it was kind of a pain there just to open it and step back. But anyway, big huge room here. We could also do a bunch of equipment as well. Uh, you can come down the stairs here. Again, once we get rails, we'll fi fix that. Uh, we got a nice little walkway here. It's a little hard to see, but it is here. And this will be what keeps us up out of the water and sludge that would be in a boat like this. And of course, back here, we'll have our engine room and engines, uh, fuel, all that can go back here. Uh, and that should, uh, fix the weight issues. Uh, most of the rest of the area here, we'll probably just close it off and do a physics flutter just or to, to save on our computers, uh, not blowing themselves up. Uh, but yeah, got controls here. This will be our helm station for the cranes. Uh, you can always go into third person and see what you're doing, which will be really nice. And hopefully we should be able to control everything and make these rescues quite nice. Uh, we should have enough room here to bring, bring the VTOL up and to bring the boat up as well. I probably should put some anchors down on the boat here to latch things down so they don't slide around. Other than that, I'm not sure where else to go. We could put a helipad up higher, uh, maybe higher up than this. So this can go up underneath the helipad. Other than that, you could probably just land a helicopter right here on the deck. That would be a thing. Uh, maybe we could put hinges here to maybe make this thing fold up and down. That could also be nice to reduce the uh, the weight of up high. You know, there she is in uh, third person. Uh, not bad. I like where it's going. I like where it's going. Uh, I've got a lot of work to do to it. We've got to work on the engines. I think we'll start researching the engines and start working on those next episode. I'd like to get this thing moving. Even if it's in its bare minimum, if it moves and it functions, we can get our VTOL and boat back. Uh, and then we can start working on other little things uh, like screens, monitors, all that stuff. Uh, navigation systems, comms, uh, systems to monitor the boat. All that can be done later. But as long as we can just kind of get it and keep it bare bones, uh, we should be good to rescue some things. I do like where it's going. I like the look of it. It looks really aggressive. looks really nice. Uh, but yeah, guys, thanks so much for watching. I appreciate you. And we will see you guys in the next one.